Hi there, coming to you live from OpenStack Austin on the OpenStack and Beyond podcast. I'm here with Rich Bowen, OpenStack uh, community liaison extraordinaire for Red Hat. Um, yesterday I was on a community panel. Uh, you actually would have been perfect for that panel, but um, what have you found has changed over the course of the years that you've been involved in the OpenStack community? A lot less what is this thing and a lot more uh, specific questions about how to implement things, how to support it going forward. Um, when I first started doing OpenStack stuff, there was a lot of people that were saying, we'd like to think about maybe planning to do that someday in the future. And now, of course, at this event, everyone's doing it. But at other events, I talk to a lot of people that are actively deploying OpenStack and encountering real world problems that they need solutions to. How do you measure your success on a community level when it comes to it's, it's a little bit amorphic sometimes. The metrics aren't exactly uh, you know, your regular metrics. Yeah, it's very difficult to, to measure community success. When we started the project that I work on, RDO, it was 100% Red Hat. And so one of the metrics that I use is how many people show up to events that are not Red Hat employees. Yesterday, we had a birds of the feather session. We had about 60 people show up. And my estimate is that 75% were not Red Hatters. So to me, that's a big success. Awesome. Um, what are the exciting things that you've done at the conference? What are the, what's the exciting news you've heard? Well, the uh, armadillo racing last night on <laughs> Rainy Street was pretty fun. Oh, fun. Um, and, you know, hanging out with coworkers and, and listening to great live music. Um, I have been working the booth the entire event, so I haven't heard a lot of the announcements. But... Uh, you know, the, the excitement around the telecoms and the NFV is, is really pretty cool. I was asked an interesting question yesterday on the panel. I would want to hear your perspective on it. Um, what do you do when community and marketing business initiatives conflict? Um, how do you kind of overcome what the business is driving versus, you know, what the community needs? Well, I have the great luxury of working entirely in the community and, and uh, you know, Red Hat, we really believe in upstream first. And so when there is a conflict between the community and the business, I get a lot of support from all the way up management to say the community really does come first. So that's that's something that, that I really treasure working at Red Hat. Awesome. I feel the same way. I work for a company that really values community, and it's a privilege to work for a company like that. Really um, anything uh, you want to tell the community about what's going on at the event, some of your thoughts? Well, we have demos all day long over in the uh, RDO booth. If people want to see real-world applications of using OpenStack, and uh, you know, have lots of fun, but but take time to actually talk to people and not just attend the the talks because it's the hallway track that makes these events so valuable. That's true, and they have awesome T-shirts. So definitely go to the Red Hat booth. Awesome seeing you again, Rich. Thanks for your time. Good to see you. Yeah, Thanks a lot. <laughs>